Hello everybody, so in this video I'm gonna show you how to download and install world edit for Minecraft Java. So let's get started. The first thing you'll do is go to your web browser and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here all you wanna do is go to your search bar and search up mod Rainf like so and then you'll find modern.com. Just click on Modern, and from there all you want to do is go to the Discover Content tab on the top of the website and then you want to go down to Mods. So here all you want to do is go on Search Mods and you want to search up World Edit and now you'll find World Edit here. Just click that and from there all you want to do is click the Versions tab. And now all you want to do is go to Game Versions and then you want to choose a Minecraft version that you want to play. I'm going to choose the latest Minecraft version. And here you want to find a fabric version for that version. So once you do this, just go ahead and click the green download button. And now all you want to do is go to a new tab and then you want to go ahead and search up for fabric Minecraft. Just enter there and then you'll find fabric on CRT.net. Just click on fabric and then you'll be on the fabric homepage. So here all you want to do is click the blue download button. And now all you want to do is click the blue download for Windows button here. And now you'll find fabric installer. So all you want to do here is close your web browser and then you want to go ahead and go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. From there all you want to do is double click the fabric installer and you should see that we have a fabric installer window with Minecraft version here and this Minecraft version you want to go ahead and choose the Minecraft version that you want to play. I chose 1.25 here, 1.25 here so we just do that and then we do install. Okay and close. And from there, all you want to do is go to the Minecraft Launcher. We want to go to the Minecraft Launcher to add the World Edit Mod to the Mods folder. And basically, the way we do this is simply by making sure that we have Fabric Loader here. And if we do, we can go to Installations here on the top. And then we can hover over Fabric Loader and go to the folder icon. From there, all you want to do is find Mods somewhere. And then you want to double click them. And from there, you want to go to Downloads. So you want to select and copy World Edit. And then you want to go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous folder and click Paste. So here we copy pasted world edit in dot Minecraft mods. So here all you want to do is go back to the Minecraft launcher. You want to go to play, make sure fabric loader is selected and click play. And from there you have to wait for the Minecraft 1.20.5 install to open up automatically. Of course you might have in other version of Minecraft and fabric and world edit this works as well. So yeah, let's just wait for Minecraft to open up real quick and then we'll be able to go ahead and try out world edit. So here's Minecraft and all you want to do here is simply go ahead and go to a single player world we'll go to a single player world here and then we'll do create new world and from there we'll just create ourselves a new world you can always use a previous existing world if you want i'll just create a new world as we'll be modifying land but the idea here is once we have a world we can go ahead and go to our inventory where we can find a wooden axe i'm also going to get a diamond hoe as well but the thing is here for example if i want to turn all of this sand here to diamond blocks i'll just go ahead and click here you can see in the chat it says first position here and i can go ahead and go here for example and use slash slash replace hashtag solid and i'll do diamond block bar. and there you go so that's the first thing here we have transformed everything into diamond blocks and for the diamond hole for example as it's not a placeable item we can do slash slash brush sphere we can do diamond block and we'll do five. And you can change the size of the spheres in the conflict files as well. You can make them a bit bigger as five is basically the default maximum for that. But yeah, that's some of the things you can also do as well with world edit. So yeah, that's how we download and install world edit for Minecraft Java. So if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.